possible for running to bird will be this. So you're running the bird. Come, come, come. You run. You jump in. As you jump in, the base loses its balance and you tumble over this way. Right? Mm -hmm. So that's why you have to be mindful uh, that you're coming over to set your hands down on the mat and have tons of like thick mats over here. So when you're laying down your wrist, it's not a lot of your wrist. Okay. So also, it's the basis job to keep their hands up the whole time. So in case you do come over, they can brace your shoulders and support some of that fall coming down. Okay. So how I like to start this is first, have you just mount bird regularly? Okay. Come in by my hands here. Hips forward, throw your arms back, shoulders back, looking up just like a bird looks. Okay. And leaning in. <laughs> Yeah, that's good. There you go. There Wait, you go. do you want to count me in? Like, sure. Here, just lean in here. I won't, I'll just support your weight first. There. Then you feel This is called like a trust fall. You just lean in the way in. Push your hips forward. Keep your hip core tight. Hips forward. Really engage your core one more time. And then on the next one, come up. Okay? Keep looking up. Shoulders back. There you go. Like that. I should feel like that. And my hands up here the whole time. In case there's a fall, boom, you have the hands right there. Even if I miss your hands, I'll catch your shoulders, and then you can brace on the ground there. Okay. Okay? It's very important to be mindful of that fall. But let's break it down bit by bit what you can do to make this work. Okay? The first thing you can do is uh, walk on up. A common mistake is flies will bend up the hips. So when they jump in, They'll, they'll feel the pressure on the hips and they'll cave in like that. Mm -hmm. You really have to push your hips forward and throw your shoulders back for this to work. Otherwise, you're going to fold over. You have to engage your core to keep your torso up. So that's the position you're looking for. Imagine point B right there, okay? Boom. Okay, coming down. Another thing is when I catch you, I need to catch you right around here because your momentum is going to bring me up right to around 90 right there. So I need to stop your momentum right there. So that's the thing, I'm gonna catch here and I'm gonna stop you right there and my hands are up as well. So to start this, I, I usually just have the flyer come on up here. All right, so Sarah, if you walk up to my feet here, do the trust fall again, hips forward. That, let's feel that, there you go. I do a few of these, three bird mounts and you come up, right? You do that first with my hands here in case you fall. Set you down. The second thing I'll do after that feels really comfortable you come back up again. Now I'll have you take one big step back and stay there. Now I'm going to have you take one step forward and then lean into the mount, okay? One step forward, hips, and lean. Beautiful. Strong core, arms back, legs lifted slightly. This is position B. Rebirth. Again, coming back. Now we'll set you down here. Now take, when you're really comfortable with that, you take two steps back. One big step and another big step. One big step, another big step. Now you take one step, two step, lean up to bird. One, two, lean up to bird. Right? And you're aware of the falls here. That's why my hands are up this way. Nice strong core. The tighter your core is, the easier it is to, for the base to balance you here. You're nice and tight. Just pretend you're like a surfboard. It's really easy for the base to base you. So that's your job. So really keep your core tight. Throw your arms back, hips forward, looking up like a bird because you go where you look. Same thing, two steps. Okay. Uh, can you come down this way a little bit? Uh -huh. Is that cool? Yeah. I'm only just thinking about Good. that being her direction of all. Certainly, certainly. Okay. okay. One, two, hips forward. Also brace the knee just like you did. That's very good. And then again. And the more times you do this, the more comfortable you'll get to going a little faster with those two steps. One, two. Very nice. One more time. Looking up. Very nice. Good, strong. 